Hi, I'm Adam from DunaJama.com. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make a cool smiley eye effect. Okay, so first we're going to start off, we're going to create this smiley eye effect. I've got my um, movie imported here. I'm just going to create a new composition. I'll call it Smile Eye. Now the important thing we need to do when creating this composition is to make sure that the frame rate here is the same as the frame rate of your movie. Now I just shot this on my eyesight from my MacBook so it's only 15 frames per second. It's very important that these match because it will help with the tracking. If the frame rates are off then the tracking won't be as effective. I'm just going to create my new composition. I'm going to drag in my movie. It's going to zoom to fit so I can line that up. There we go. The first thing we need to do is to track the eyes. To do that we need to select the movie down here, right click and then select track motion. This will open up the tracker panel down here and also add track point one to your movie. Now we need to select this and just move it over the eye. Pretty simple. Then we also need to check the rotation box down in the tracker window to add tracker point 2 which we will set over here. Now sometimes when you select it it moves this little point in the middle sometimes it doesn't I'm not quite sure why. There we go. And that will just enable so as your it tracks both points it will check the difference in the thing and it'll basically it should just make your the eye the smiley face rotate as your head tilts in theory now what we're next we're going to do is we're going to actually track the motion i'm just going to click down here on the analyze forward button and i'll show you what happens see it's, it's tracking it pretty well you see there at the end it kind of goes a bit crazy But in general, it's not been too bad actually. But I'm going to control Z that because I know at the end it goes crazy. I'm just going to analyze forward and stop there because that's when it goes crazy. Now I'm going to use this one, which is analyze one frame forward, just to go to where the eyes open again. I'm doing it frame by frame because this way, if like there, I can. If you go too far, then you can just control Z and you only have to undo one frame at a time. Yep, now I'm just going to select this and move it over here if I can select the correct. There we go. And then. this one over here as well and hopefully if we just try this through a frame at a time we can just adjust it slightly so we can get it perfectly in the right spot now this may just take a bit of time and effort just to get this right but it's worth it in the end again we just go forward couple frames and this is, seems to be okay now it seems to pick it up again so we're just going to analyze forward to the end and there we have we should have the entire thing tracked and we can just drag that through a bit and you can see it's it's done a pretty good job of tracking that now we need to add a null object which is where we will save all the track point data into so we just go up to layer and then new and null object there we have the null object down there and we come over to the tracker panel and we just go to edit target and we set it as the null layer click OK and we're just going to apply all the tracking data to that null object by clicking apply and then OK now we've created this little box here which will be invisible on the final render and everything this is just all data points that it's stored and you can see all the keyframes down here for the different the positions I'm just going to collapse that and that's the first stage done and now we need to add in our smiley face 